When I was 10, our fifth grade teacher, Nora, wanted to do the choreography of Rock Around the Clock so we could perform it at the end of the year. She gathered us in duets and I ended up with him, the boy I had a crush on. I was so happy because we finally could be a couple, dance partners, and I could spend more time with him. Everything was fine as days went by and we were rehearsing until one day Nora came up with a new step, the koala step, in which the girl had to jump on the boy, put her legs around his waist and then jump down. The only idea of that step scared me. I double-sized my partner, because I was 10, and really, he was very thin. Anyway, I had faith. Maybe because I had just done my communion that year, or maybe because I was a little naive. But when the day came, I got prepared and I was ready to do it. So, I jumped right on him. And it was a disaster. We both ended up on the floor. I ended up on top of him in a sort of sexual position, which I didn't know because I was 10. And everybody turned around and stared at us. It was so embarrassing. He didn't say anything. I giggled. And Nora, she separated us. She put him with another girl, the most beautiful and popular girl of the classroom, of course. And I ended up with another fat 10 year old who pickled his nose a lot. But that is not the worst part. That December, everybody in my classroom danced rock around the clock. But me and my new partner and another couple of fat 10 year old, we couldn't do the koala step. No. When that step came, we had to do another step that was something like this. I mean, what kind of lesson is that? One, two, three o'clock, four o'clock, rock. Five, six, seven o'clock, eight o'clock, rock. Nine, ten,